Hey Digital How To's, welcome back. Today I wanted to show you guys a really cool website. If you're into, you know, print on demand, Etsy, you love selling on those platforms, this is the site for you. Before we get started, please smash that like button, subscribe, and check out my description for how to make money online. So this website's called kiddo.com. Basically, once you sign up, you get 15 credits. After the 15 credits, you obviously have to pay. And once you're in, it looks like this. So you can do Kiddo AI logos, labels, t-shirts, posters, cards, social media, Y2K, or streetwear. So if you click on, for example, t-shirts, it's going to show you all the designs that people have designed. You can also use the designs. And for example, if we like this, you can click into it and you can see who made it and it looks cool and then you can also click here to use the design 871 people have used it um, but I'm not going to use that so what I'm going to do I'm going to show you is how to create your own so you're going to click on new project and then once you click on new project you can pick the size you want I'm going to do a poster small for a t-shirt and I'm going to leave it at this frame instead of going sideways then I'm going to click create then once you're in here, you've got a blank canvas. You're going to click the star here for Kitty AI, and it's going to take you here. And then here is where you want to write your um, description of what you want for your T-shirt. So I'm thinking, you know, something cute, something funny. Um, so I'm going to say a lot of kissy kawaii lips okay and then the image style you can pick here different image styles that you want I'm gonna do the anime one and then the clip styles you can pick here too it shows you the clip styles that you want right here or you can do vector styles or pattern so I'm actually gonna do pattern and then I'm gonna generate my image and let's see what we get here. So it takes a little and you know it's actually pretty fast considering and so here is my kissy image. I don't quite love that. I find it to be very meh. So I'm going to delete that. Um, let's try a digital art image. I'm going to go on to my mid journey and just use one of my prompts so I don't have to think too hard right now because it takes me a long time to sit there and like really think about you know what I want to like write so I'm just going to copy my prompt here and then I'm just going to come back and just put that in there and then I'm just going to look at this the images and you can pick from, you know, which one you like. I think I'm going to do digital art. Though this one is really nice too. Painted. Okay, I'm going to do digital art. Do art. Create. Generate image. And then I'm going to sit and wait. And, you know, 13 credits, I mean 15 credits is not a lot. Because, you know, when you keep playing with it and you're not happy with it. Okay, so this is what I got. It looks nothing close to my mid journey one that I copied here. But, you know, doesn't look that bad. You can brighten it here, darken it like so. There you go. And let's just say that I'm happy with this. Okay, and I thought this was cool. It's kind of cool, but also kind of creepy. Not exactly what I was looking for, but you know whatever okay so then we can do templates here this is the template button where you can click on and you know scroll through check it out and you can replace what you're doing here which I don't want to do that but you can also add a text so let's just add that I'm gonna change this to mm, white and then let's just write something cool. 
let's just say magic is whoops and then I'm gonna actually undo that so I'm gonna change this magic is within you actually I'm gonna spell out the whole you I'm just gonna delete this oops that's not what I wanted to do okay you There you go. And then I'm just gonna delete that part. Magic is within you. There you go. And then you can, you know, add textures to it. Change it. Let's show all the textures here. Like that looks rustic. Like, see, that looks kind of cool. I actually like that. So you just keep playing with it pretty much. And once you're happy with it, then you can download it. And then upload it to your Redbubble. Like that. Let's do some grains instead. There you go. Okay. And see, so my project is done, and this is the final image for my red bubble, or sorry, for my digital, um, not my red bubble. So I'm going to download it, and you can download it as a PNG or a JPEG. So I'm just going to do JPEG. I'm going to allow it to download. And it's downloaded into my computer. Now let me show you how you would upload this image to Redbubble. Okay, so I've actually decided to do Printified instead of Redbubble. Because I have the account open already. So once you go into Printified, for example, to upload your image, you're going to go into Category. And you're going to pick, I'm going to do a men's t-shirt. And then you pick a t-shirt that you like. I'm going to go with this one. And then start designing. And at this point is where you would put your design in. So I need to find that design that I just did right here. And then we're just going to resize it like that. Okay. And then just stretch this out a bit more. Okay, so it shows that it's low resolution. So what I'm going to do is that I'm actually going to go into big, big um, jpeg.com here. And I'm going to select my image. And I'm going to enlarge this image. And then just scroll down. Press start and you can do it on four for free or you can do it on eight if you pay. So two and four is free, eight you gotta pay. Start. Cancel. Okay, so now it's gonna download. So while we wait for that to download, I wanted to show you guys also if you were to take this image. And let me just say delete that. And I'm going to download this to a JPEG. You can upload this to your Adobe too because you made this image. So let's go back and see if it's done. No, it's almost done. So what we're going to do is once this image gets enlarged and it's better quality, then we're going to go back into Printified and we're just going to stick it here. I'm just going to trash this one because that 
quality was not as good. And so bear with me, we're just waiting for this to enlarge and get a better quality. And then we're going to upload it. So you know what, I'm going to pause the video until it's done and then I'll show you how to upload it. Okay, so it's done. Let's just click into it. Let's just go to my devices. And you see how the resolution is 6000 now from 768 big difference. So we're going to click on that. There you go. And now we just have to zoom out a little bit up here and down here. Perfect. There you go. And then obviously you can change the color of your t-shirt, but I'm just going to leave it white and it looks good. We can preview it. There you go. And you know, see a man wearing it, a woman wearing it. Like that looks pretty cool, right? So you save the product. So honestly, this Kittle site is awesome. And then obviously at this point you can, you know, price it and so forth. Um, but this Kittle.com site is very awesome because you can make all these graphics really fast, upload it to Printified or Redbubble and make some money. I hope you guys try it. I will leave the link down below. And just so you know, it is only 15 um, tries after that you do have to pay. Um, so it's not free. So you can also create with the, this is great with the kiddo AI, get inspiration. Let's see how much it costs here. Um, pricing right here. So this is theirs free. You get 15 credits for single use works up to 20 projects or you can go pro $10 a month, 20 credits a month. And it says works on a hundred projects. This one says works on 20 projects, but I only did one and I used up three credits already. So I don't know. And then the expert one is $24. You get a hundred credits. This one is the business one, $79 a month, up to five users in one account. So that's their pricing. Um, not so bad if you do the pro, it says a hundred projects, but yeah. If you're indecisive like me, then you know it takes more credits because I'm always playing with it. But I hope you guys check this out. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.